I'm Martin James and I'm a stroke physician in Exeter and I've been working with colleagues in Penn Clark on a project to improve the delivery of vital clock busting treatment to people with stroke. Our business in providing a stroke service is all about trying to reduce the amount of disability that people end up with after a stroke, uh, particularly as that's a lifetime of disability. So our focus was always on delivering as much treatment, clock busting treatment, uh, as possible as quickly as possible. We were very excited about this project because it came directly from the consultant at the hospital and it fitted very well with our methods. Uh, we could use computer simulation which is a means of using a computer to model the pathway of a patient in that stage of their care and um, we were able to then show that simulation for a range of different change scenarios. So when Penn Clark presented their results to us, we sat down as a team to look at how we thought we could make improvements from it and it became quite clear that if we were alerted to patients arriving with the stroke before they actually got there, we would be able to shave off quite a lot of time on that patient pathway. So their patient flow is much quicker, their treatment is much earlier, and they're in the right place at the right time. If you look at the raw numbers, then what we saw happen over the course of the next uh, 12 to 18 months or so was more than doubling in the number of people who received clot busting treatment. And also, of course, the time that it took to deliver the treatment came down dramatically as well, again, by almost half. But I think we saw another effect as well, not just for those people who received the treatment, but it seemed to spill over into the general attitude to people with stroke, regarding it as a medical emergency where time was of the essence, even if it wasn't just about clot busting treatment. We have very little understanding of what computer modelling it consisted of or what it meant but it was absolutely amazing so for us to do this traditionally we would have had to get permission from the hospital from the board of ethics it would have taken us months and months to implement any change. Penn Clark came in they did the modelling and we were implementing change within weeks and it's fantastic to see such an improvement in patient care so easily.